Secant pile walls are used to construct in-ground retaining walls. Because these piles are cut into each other, they form a continuous wall, which can reduce water inflow into the excavation in front of the wall, as well as retaining the soil behind the wall. Secant piles can be constructed using board cast in place, or continuous flight auger methods, cased or conventional CFA. First, a shallow guide wall has to be built. This guide wall is shaped to locate the piles to tight tolerances, ensuring that the overcut from one pile into another is as required by the wall design. The guide wall is constructed from reinforced concrete. Often polystyrene or timber void formers are used to obtain the scalloped shape of the inner face of the guide walls. Once the guide wall has developed sufficient strength, the piles are constructed through it. The wall can be made from alternating soft and hard piles, in which case the soft pile is usually unreinforced, or from alternating full strength piles, in which case both male and female piles may be reinforced. First, the preliminary or female piles are drilled to the required depth. Generally, these piles are constructed in a hit and miss sequence in order to ensure that adjacent piles are not damaged by drilling nearby until the low strength concrete is set. After allowing sufficient curing time, the remaining preliminary piles are constructed. Careful attention must be given to the concrete mix used in the preliminary piles to ensure that it has sufficient strength when the secondary piles are cut into it, but gain strength after that with continued curing. Once sufficient preliminary piles have been constructed, the secondary or male piles are then drilled between adjacent preliminary piles. The secondary pile is cut into or secanted into the two preliminary piles either side of it. By careful control of the verticality tolerance when drilling, it's ensured that the overlap between preliminary and secondary piles remains intact down to the underside of the deepest excavation level. Subsequent secondary piles are then constructed, forming a continuous retaining wall. Secant pile walls are often used for basement construction or to form cuttings into existing slopes or embankments. When the area inside the wall is excavated, temporary support in the form of whalers and props or anchors are often used. Piling Contractors. Think safe, work safe, home safe.